All right, in today's video, we unlocked a new dome in Mario Galaxy, and they call it the kitchen. I'm seeing utensils, but I don't understand why they call it the kitchen. Are all Is there going to be the... food levels? Uh... Yeah, are the, are the levels all food related? Or are they all... It's the floor made out of linoleum. Okay, well, we don't know until we actually go into one, so I suppose... Let's, to... <laughs> let's try form. this one. <laughs> uh, Beach, Beach Bowl Galaxy! Wait. That has nothing to do with the kitchen at all. Hold okay. on. Okay. I, you I got was actually me. assuming there would be like food related things. <laughs> well, bowl. <laughs> you put food in a bowl, don't you? Not in a beach bowl. You know, today, earlier I, I, for dinner, I had a bowl of chili. Ooh, that sounds delicious. And I even had to make it myself because my wife looked at me and said, You're making dinner tonight. And I <laughs> wow, said, Yes, ma'am. She ma said it like that. Yeah, well, I had do? to clean it up a lot. Oh, okay. I got in trouble. Oh, okay. That's normal. I, I can see that happening. I compared her to a, another large mammal. Oh, no. <laughs> you did not. No, I'm, just, I'm just kidding. That's like rule number one of I just was walking past this large mammal, and I thought it would be a funny joke. The students are distracted by the sparklies. So okay, I'm well. guessing you have to go and get the sparklies. Yeah, that's They look like things us. that you need to get. So, hold on. So, why do they call it the kitchen? And I'm not talking um, about this game at this point. Basement dwellers, let us know in the comments below. Oh, why do they call kitchens kitchen? Yeah, why do you think they call the ki an actual kitchen the kitchen? That's a good question. Is it because it's where you cook chicken? It's named after the part of the billiards table. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's named after the part of the table and pool where you where even you scratch the ball <laughs> you put the ball in the kitchen and yeah, some guy was like oh my gosh this is totally where you put like the apples and the oranges and the pomegranates and the and the pomelos and the watermelons those are like pool balls all right let's call this place go the kitchen <laughs> sparkly's here how do we dive there's a way to do it there it I'm, is I'm going to I'm going to look it up. I'm going to see where the word kitchen comes from. The etymology. Where does the word kitchen Oh, this the music is so originate. good in this level. All right, guys. From the verb cocere came the later Latin noun cocina, meaning kitchen. With some changes in pronunciation, cocina came into Old English as kitchine. This kitchen. became Middle English kitchene, and finally Modern English kitchen. <laughs> wow, kitchen, <laughs> kitchen, which is really funny to me because like coquina sounds like something else. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like something they used to put in Coca Cola. <laughs> yeah, cocoa. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, it's do you ever go to a, like an old timey restaurant and get a chocolate coke? Wait, a chocolate Coke? Yeah, have you never had a chocolate Coke? No, dude. What is this? Yeah, or like a vanilla Coke? They have them at a... I've had a vanilla Coke because it comes in cans, but Coca-Cola... Like, I feel like if they make chocolate Coke at old-timey restaurants, this is something that Coca-Cola is not capitalizing on. They should make yeah. chocolate Coke in a can because that sounds really good. Is it good? Yeah, it's pretty good. I mean, oh, it's, maybe it's that's kind why of a novelty. Maybe, maybe it didn't perform well in the market testing because it's not it's great, not but it's great. fun in a restaurant. Like it's just a big old plate of French fries and a chocolate Coke. You can make it yourself with just Hershey's syrup and Coke. You, wait, you just put syrup in a Coca Cola? I mean, it sounds weird, but you put it in and you stir it up and you drink it. It's not bad. Huh? Okay, where's the last sparkly? Mario. Yeah, I oh, feel like. God. I mean, I feel like. Coca-Cola should really also do like a, I don't know, some kind of like, maybe they, they consider themselves like a family-friendly company, but I feel like they're missing out on some marketing opportunities with like Captain Morgan and, and oh. Hershey Syrup and, yeah. you know, like an ice cream company. Like what if, like the best thing that ever happened to root Coke beer float. is someone yeah, was like, root beer float. hey, I'm going to invent the root beer float, right? So yeah, like, why don't sure. Coke just say like, "Hey, it's the new Coke float. It's the same as a root beer float, but with Coca Cola, and therefore better somehow." We call it the Colot. Oh, maybe it's in this box. What's we in the box? It, what's What's in the green box? Aha! Ah it's a sparkles. 
Five of five. It's a flota cola. You did it, Peter. Everyone in this level right now is going, oh boy, water levels. Yeah, dude, I'm excited for it to get on the grass. Yay! So ah, you're dead. Oh, it's a so bunny. That now, now, now my actual question arrives. Why okay. did they call this area the kitchen? Is it? Does it kind of like? Do, 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 do. Is each of is each do, of the places do, do, do. in that space station a uh, a room of a house? Well, it's kind of it's Rosalina's home and the home of all the lonely Lumas that have joined her. Okay, so it's like so it's their kitchen. Got it. So it's actually she cooks meals and stuff there, huh? I guess. The Lumas just eat star bits, though, so she just needs to make sure she can eat. Is she human? Where am I supposed to go? Rosalina? Or is she a dancer? <laughs> <laughs> She's definitely not human. Are we human? If you want to grab something up high, spin it after you jump. Oh, I already talked to you. And you already know this how to do I... that, too. You're not some noob. This is You're not I got some here. Yeah, chocolate but I coke been. drinking, old timey French fries eating noob. Oh, don't French fries sound so good? Don't even remind me, Peter. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. Actually, you know, Dad. the thing that I'm missing the most right now is just s sweet things. Because I can't have oh, like, I... like any sweeteners of any type. Yeah, like, that's a bummer. No honey, no nothing. I can only have stevia, which is not that great. It's okay. It's it's really bitter though. Like do do do. And like with sugar, the more you put on, the better it tastes. With stevia, it can only get so sweet, and then it starts tasting bad. Oh, bummer. So what are you putting stevia in, and what are you just putting nothing in? So I'm just avoiding foods that are supposed to taste sweet in general, but I, I have found something that's pretty decent with this uh, dietary restriction that I'm doing, and that is almond milk with a couple drops of stevia is oh. pretty, like vanilla almond milk. It's pretty good. It's not that works. It's like it's the amazing. closest thing that I can get to. <gasps> a ice hungry cream. Luma appeared. Ooh, let's in the kitchen. <coughs> of course, what a perfect spot. Well, we have let. Wait, go feed the hungry Luma. But I want to see <clears throat> what's in the box. No, no, no. We'll do that next episode. Luma? Go feed the Luma. He'd better transform. <laughs> you said that with such disdain. <laughs> okay. And you know he's he, gonna. He better he transform. Star bits. Snacky happiness. Oh, thank you for fixing 600. my phone. Six hundred. We so got it. I can it. see. So, yeah, uh, these few episodes are recording at a distance, and so I'm watching through a phone, through a Zoom meeting, to be able to watch. Who fixed it? And the phone Did fell so forward a little bit ago, but then Peter fixed it. But now the phone's falling backward. Or, no, no, it's not. It was an optical illusion. It looked like it was falling backwards, but it's great. Oh, I thought you were talking to him. That, so, uh, where is this? Someone fixed your phone. Where does it shoot you there to now? Uh, Whoa. The new new place. Drip drop. Well, that drip sounds like drop. fun to me. Never going to stop. Giant eel outbreak. Ooh. Hey, drip drops happen in kitchens. You know, drip. when you drop your food. Yeah, you drip, you drip your food. You drop Whoa, your food. I'm an old penguin. Drip drop. I was hopping on pop. All, up on All a about a Saturday night. night. But do do do. <laughs> Uh oh, that was totally in sync from my perspective. Yeah, which that means, means it's wasn't. out of sync. I have to start all the songs. Okay, start oh. one. <laughs> splish splash, I was taken. Oh, that's the, the same song. Get rid of the big eels. Okay, can I borrow your turtle shell? Thank you. Oh, uh, I want to eat an eel right now. Eat an eel? Yeah. Like on a on a piece of sushi, like eel sushi. I thought you were say a piece of toast. Okay, how do I get rid of big eels? I can't Can remember. I you guys like sushi, right? Light at them? Oh, look, I have brake lights. <laughs> <laughs> That's to signal all the fish that are behind you and tailgating you. Uh-oh. Oh. You just threw your shell. 
I did. Let's see if we can grab another one. I wonder if I'm supposed to... If I just shine light on them, will it... How do I get rid of them? I think you gotta shoot a shell at them. Like let go while I'm facing them? Either that or it looked like there was a bullet, a torpedo chasing you. Maybe you gotta make a torpedo run into him. Oh, Ooh. that was definitely it. Yeah, I bet you could do it with the bullets too. Well, what's in the what's in the treasure chest? What's in the box? What's in the box? Dude, remember when? I don't when, know. I can't open it. Remember well, when? Maybe he'll Luigi open it. Oh. Yeah, da, 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 da. That torpedo was there like at just the right time. Remember yeah, when thanks, Lu buddy. Luigi drowned? <laughs> Yes, <laughs> in our Mario 64 playthrough, that was uh, brilliant. My brother! <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm still smiling. Yeah, that was... That's how great it was. I think that that's got to be one of the funniest things that's ever happened in the basement. Oh, for sure. I mean, okay, there were a lot of great jump. things. There have been a lot of funny things that have happened. That and the, the floppy Link, when he was on a quest to save a princess... Well, I'm low on air. I gotta get a bubble here. Ah. Mmm, bubbles. You loved that floppy link. That was like the highlight of your day. Oh, that was like the highlight of my several months. It was like you can tell when I was <laughs> I was uncontrollably laughing at that. Yeah, you you were. And I could tell I thought you were just laughing to laugh, because I thought it was funny, but not that funny. It is but fun then later, to just laugh, but yeah. When you edited and like it repeated eight times in the video, I was like, oh yeah, this is Ted's favorite. <laughs> he was really laughing at this. Well, like that was genuine. Cause like as it, it, it came on in waves, right? Like at first it was funny because he flopped at the camera. And then I was like, right. Wait, his leg, his leg was all yeah. up by his face. <laughs> and then he woo. <laughs> <laughs> it did. It compounded. Uh, wow, we I, discovered another new galaxy. We're just tearing it up, dude. You're killing it. You're killing it, Peter. We're, we're tearing it right up. I wish, man, I wish you were playing. But, but uh, you can't. Basement dwellers who are watching this, what's your favorite funny moment that has happened in the basement ever that you can think of? And mm. if you don't know any because you're it new It doesn't here, have to be a funny moments video moment. Thanks so much for watching, and welcome to the basement. Uh... It is the friendliest place on YouTube. We didn't say that right away. Yeah, we, um, we're I don't know. Trying try something a little bit new. Although, uh, we probably should should remember to say it in like the first 30 seconds. And invite people to subscribe and like and hit all the comments. Oh, that's true. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Uh, it's free. And, and that easy. notification and it helps bell. The channel. Beautiful stuff. Uh, do we want this one? I think we do. Yeah, let's do it. Let's see what's in here. Oh, it's the ghostly galaxy. Remember when we did this for our Halloween special? Yes, I do. Well, now that uh, Christmas is coming, it is time to do a Luigi Halloween in the Haunted Mansion. This is fantastic. This is a really, really great level. I love Luigi up there. Although, they have the character model. Why couldn't you just... Make him playable, dude. I suppose mm, this, this make game... Make him a playable, dude? This game would not have been good two-player. Maybe you'll get that for Christmas. Dude, are you excited for Christmas? Yeah, I am. It's like upon us. It, it really is. There's holiday music in the stores that I can't go to, and and all the restaurants I'm not allowed to go <laughs> in. And <laughs> I could just jump. I could jump on your head forever. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Good old Christian music. That's an oldie, dude. I could sing of your love forever. Is that an old one? Yes. I've lost touch with what's old. That's, I mean, we're old. But I guess we are. I mean, it's not like an old, like, hymn. Ugh. <sighs> But I mean, that song was new in like '94. <laughs> so... Yeah, that I, that would qualify it as pretty old then, <laughs> <laughs> right? I don't remember the rest of the song. Oh, I do. Just <laughs> love forever. Come and get me, Mr. Boo. 
Come I dare on, into the light. Oh, oh, now you are a dead ghost. <laughs> you finally released him from his immortal coil. <laughs> immortal coil? <laughs> Wish I could move this. It feels like that's that totally be should be a thing. Point. It's I stupid like it that it's be. not. Ooh, I've got a key inside of my belly. You know, you should be more afraid of the light and less afraid of Mario. You might die less. <laughs> well, What I happens mean, when you destroy a ghost? Does it become alive? No, it moves on. Oh. That's, yeah. that, I mean, that's that's the, that's the common, idea. commonly accepted belief system ghosts about ghosts. Because stuck and they can't. Oh, I didn't realize that Candle ah! could flame me. I showed our friend um, Dave Terminal Montage for the first time last night. He didn't know Terminal Montage? Dude, he doesn't know any YouTube. Oh, I cannot Kay. believe that Goomba just killed me. And, and listen, that he, play, he plays Minecraft, but yeah. he had never seen an Iron Golem. What? How? <laughs> I, I don't know. He's play, he, I think he plays on an old Java server with his, parent, with his dad. And it... So, they don't have villages yet. <laughs> well, they had they had villages, right? But they didn't have iron golems right away. Yeah, I guess that was a different update. Now, Still, it, though, that's pretty that's pretty old, though, to yeah. not have iron golems. But Dude, yeah, I wonder if he would even like. There's been so many updates since then. I wonder if he would even enjoy it. Well, we played we played uh, last night together. Because oh, he was like, you? oh, what are we going to play? You know, because we, we hang out every couple weeks here and there, and we just nice. just kind of shoot the breeze and just have, you know, bro time where we're not, that's, you know, we might talk good. about I stuff saw going him on with at, the families and stuff. I saw him at the store not too long ago, and I snuck up on him kind of like a creeper, and I just stood real close to him. And then he went. And he suddenly <laughs> noticed me. And then you and I had a mask on. <laughs> and you had bombs strapped to your chest, and you blew no. yourself up. <laughs> well, you oh, said you're like a creeper. <laughs> yeah, did you ever read the theory that creepers are like meant to be like suicide bombers? Oh my gosh, that's terrible. <laughs> I know. I'm like, I don't think that's it. I think it's just a. I think they like, just an explode. enemy that blows up is hazardous yeah. and, and it's therefore a, compelling. It's a pretty common type of Whoa. monster in games too to have them. You know, certain monsters that blow up. Yeah. Wow, Mario. Mario. Quite the flight. Mario. Help! I'm Luigi and I need your help. <laughs> Dude, you can't adjust the camera at all. Hey, a key. There's a key, I ye. Oh! <laughs> I did not do that as well as I should have. Well Whoop. stinking done. Excuse me, ghosts. Yeah. Ghosts I, don't die. Can you get out of here alive? Hmm. Oh, yeah. We got to. I remember this. In order to rescue a ghost, you have to think like a ghost. Become yeah. the ghost. Press A to vanish. Watch out. It's light, Mario. You're allergic to light. Oh, you know what? I'll bet I can get this one up. Come can you on. jump? You can fly, right? Yeah, no, I can't really jump. Well, you can fly. You can go up. Do I go up? Go back and get that. Go back and get that one up. Like that. That's how you go up. Oh, they fell in love with me. They can hurt you. They can turn you into Mario again. Get out of there. Oh my gosh, they're chasing you. Dude, it's fine. They like me. Okay, get that one up now. Oh, that's how it's done. It's a ghost up. <laughs> it's a one down. <laughs> Get back here. Thank oh, you. it's one of those runny, scared green mushroom. Oh, he came right through. He didn't even have to disappear. Can you die in the light, please? Thank you. <laughs> well, you, you really snuck past that light. I sure did. I'm a sneaky ghost. Oop. Okay. He's a sneaky Whoa, ghost. Boy. Okay, so we gotta slip through here and become then we gotta... Mario. Yes, on porpoise. 
I remember how the game works. Oh, thank you. We're both stuck here forever somehow. Yeah, I don't understand how you going there helps him. Well, when you touch a star, you're automatically transported out of wherever you are. But apparently it doesn't work for Luigi. No, Luigi... He's... No, we just left him there. Well, yeah. Oh, oh no. Nope. Here you go. I'm here, too. Oh. <laughs> I'm one of Mario's don't... best and oldest friends. Don't forget about me. <coughs> Rosalina, the Lumas, Bowser, Yoshi, Mario, and Princess Peach, plus their friends, all went home and lived happily ever after. <laughs> Isn't that what it Name said? Name like all of the minor characters. The Green Toad, <laughs> Yellow Toad, Red Toad, and the rest of their friends. <laughs> it's just Luigi. <laughs> <laughs> Is that how our Mario RPG ended? Oh, I don't know. Because Luigi should have so. been in that game, too. Yeah, well... Later on, there was coulda. a series called um, Mario and Luigi Superstars, or Mario and Luigi something. Did you hear yeah. about those games? Yeah. Did you ever play them? No. They were like, they were Super Mario RPG. They were like, uh, totally cool. that. Um, I should play them. Aren't they on like the DS, though? Yes, but... Is there a way to play it via yeah. virtual something? Yeah. Yeah, dude, you can play them on the channel. I can get it set all, all set up for you. Ooh, nice. That'd be cool. That could be fun. That could be fun. Um, we. Let's see if we can find a quick one in the kitchen. Ooh, when's the last time you played Odyssey? Because... Uh, it's been a while. I logged into it, and there are a bunch of new costumes that I didn't know about. Oh, really? Yeah, like I have a Wa a Waluigi costume and a Luigi costume and a Wario costume. And I'm pretty sure those weren't there before. Yeah, I don't remember that. A Wario costume? Yeah. And a and a I would Diddy run around as Wario. And a Diddy Kong costume. <laughs> it all of a sudden just gets so serious. Oh, hello, I'm a strapping young uh, penguin. I'm a little kind of fat. You want to take a swim test? <laughs> Collect the shells of the ocean. If you bring me a gold shell, it's an automatic A. Good luck. Have fun. Look for the gold shell. It's an automatic A. Wow. Dude, that's a pretty easy class. If you're yeah. Mario. Well, you gotta find the... Being one of those uh, penguins must make it really easy. Yeah, that's true. Penguins swim like fish, bro. Is it behind one of these guys? Boy, the camera is not happy with me right now. Nor I with it. <laughs> you two don't go together like peas in a pod, that's for sure. You go together hey. like peas in uh, uh, two different pods. Hey, that's a gold shell. <laughs> <laughs> ha, 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 ha. I stole it from you. you How you like them, you Apples? You stole it from the other students? I'm a... I'm a... Bully. Whoops. Where's the instructor? So, wait, the students were carrying that and you just took it out of their hands? I did. I yoinked it. He was like, time. finally, Dad's going to be proud of me. I'm going to get an A on my test. Oh, Give me thing, Mario! Kid. Now I'm well, only going to so get an A minus. I'm so glad you stole this from my son. Here's a gold star. I took it out of my belly button. I keep it in my navel. I got five of these things. They're all my lint. It would make sense living on the ocean that I would keep things in my navel. I hope that maybe you will throw that gold shell at a little boy. Okay. <laughs> all right. You get another A. Ah, I fell down. All right, guys. We did it. We succeeded. We're amazing. And so are you. Come back and join us next week for more Mario Galaxy in the, in the basement. basement.